Hi people, how's it going? Welcome to my round of 16 Euros predictions. Please like, share and follow. Firstly, I'd like to congratulate Georgia and Romania. Romania not qualifying to knockout stage of the European tournament since, 20, since 2000. And Georgia, first time they've even qualified to the Euros and then the knockout stage. And Turkey, who have not been to knockout stage for 16 years. Fantastic. Well, on to the um, predictions. Firstly, I'd like to start with Switzerland against Italy. A big round of 16 match, of course, but it all. Italy might be marginally favourites, but no disrespect to Switzerland, they've got a fantastic team, fantastic set, set up. Um, whoever wins this plays England, of course. I think it's going to be 1 1 at full time. Go to extra time. Switzerland will lead, Italy will equalise right at the depth, go to penalties, and it's going to be Switzerland 5, Italy 6. I'm sorry, Swiss. On to the second game on Saturday, you've got Germany against Denmark. I think Denmark will lead at half time, and then Germany will score from Fulkrig and Wurz, and Musiala will have a shot which, from a bare deflection, we put the ball wide, it's curling into the corner. And after that, Denmark come close to equalising and taking it to extra time. But Germany wins 2 1. England against Slovakia. I'm sorry, England. England are coming home, not football. Sack, it's going to be sacked. It's going to be the end. Nah. Um, I think England will struggle, though. Slovakia will take the lead. England will equalise. In the 106th minute, you have Foden or Rice from outside the area will score the winner to send England to that quarter final against Italy. The second game on Sunday, Spain against Georgia. Um, Georgia were a fantastic campaign you've had as I just mentioned. Um yeah, to get to knockout stages in your first tournament. Phenomenal. Spain, however, I have I think we'll have a bit too much class for you, I'm, I'm afraid. Um Spain is a fantastic side, and yeah. Um, so, despite Georgia's winning against Portugal, we're a dead rubber, really. Both have qualified. Spain to Georgia nil. On to Monday, stop the French against the Belgium. France against Belgium. I think France had too much of Belgium. Belgium are not that good. Not long ago, Belgium were one of the favourites to win the Euros. Um, but as they've aged, of course then haven't got that about them anymore. And um, I think France, Mbappe and go 2 0 France. Simple. Portugal against Slovenia. I know Slovenia gave England a game, but I mean, you're talking about crap performance from England. I know it's just rare, but on YouTube, but well, I'm being honest. Um, I think Portugal will show how England should play, I mean, being clinical and so on. Um, but Portugal concede, which England should learn not to do. To, to do. So, um, Portugal 3, Slovenia 1. Sorry, Slovenia, but Portugal have a bit much to class for you. On to Tuesday, Romania against Netherlands. I think Romania might take the lead. Or Netherlands take the lead and Romania equalise. Maybe that be it. And then Netherlands equalise. Um, we're scoring in like the last 10 minutes or something. So, sorry, Romania. It's going to be um, Netherlands who head through to the quarterfinals. But a good stepping stone for Romania. Um, so yeah, two one Netherlands. Turkey against Austria. This is gonna be a classic. One one at half time. One one at full time. One one after extra time. Yeah, Turkey three, Austria three. Goes to penalties. Turkey four, Austria five. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching my round of sixteen European predictions. Again, please like, share and follow. And again, congratulations on your historic achievements for Georgia, Romania and Turkey. But for now, I'm out. Thanks. Bye.